Okay, we should all be familiar with this broadcaster by now, UK TV and its family of channels, each showcasing a different genre, comedies, drama, entertainment and factual, the broadcaster had it all. UK TV traces its origins back to 1992. Coming together to bring you the UK very Gold. best of British television a television on a new channel. satellite and cable channel, the very UK best Gold. From the, from the vaults of Thames television Imagine and an BBC. entertainment channel devoted really to bringing you some of the most popular of programs of all time. That everyone started to a schedule of classic into. drama, classic comedy, classic children's programs. Taking the mickey. Well, of course they were, you see, now I'll get great. Super sick. <laughs> Great Scott! Ah! Well, I certainly wouldn't call it a useless twit, but UK TV later on grew and grew and grew. In fact, the network originally launched back in 1997. Y'all ready for this? This is UK TV. A unique new family of channels bringing together the best of BBC programmes. And a whole host of people you'll probably recognise. Individual channels. Tailored especially for you. Tailored especially for you, you say. Well, this is a bit of an odd coincidence and a bit of a cliche. Because I am not here to talk about the history of UK TV. I'm here to talk about exactly what it's about to become. And trust me. It looks horrible. Check this out. This monstrosity of a logo. This awful rebrand. This stupid name. You. What's so good about the letter U in the history of broadcasting? Well, I'm going to explain more. Here we go. On the 29th of November 2023, UKTV announced to create U, a new master brand which will unite its family of channels and, and its streaming service UKTV Play. Launching it this summer, it will see that its current streaming service, UK, UK TV Play, transition to, to it, and its and UK TV's family of channels, including Dave, Dave, Drama, and Yesterday and W, will become You and Dave, You and Drama, You and Yesterday, and You and W. The channel e even teased these bumpers, which, which, aired, which aired recently ac across those channels. This is what Penny Bro, UK TV's current Chief Marketing Officer said. For 30 years, UK TV has had shows that people are passionate about. Crime, drama, witty comedy and more. But now it's felt disconnected. We want to make sure our audiences can enjoy the full range of our free and wonderfully diverse offer. So we're making it easier for them to navigate. You is the glue that enables us to do this. It means we go to market with a bold, distinctive, and simple and distinctive identity for our streaming service. You makes it easier for people to connect the dots between the streaming service and our family of TV channels, all while keeping hold of, the ch of each channel's unique personality and fame. This is now a family that is fit for a digital future, but it's simple, but still full of personality because it's all about you. Well, to be truthful, I, I really d disagree, disagree with this. In fact, UK TV already rebranded all their channels in 2008. And do you know what really grinds my gears? That, it, that 10 years ago, UK TV Play was launched. I mean, what's the point of renaming it to, to a single letter when you can just freaking just call it UK TV Play anyway? Oh boy, this is one rebrand that I am definitely am not going to get used to.
and I thought the X rebranding of Twitter was bad. Come with us, have a play, and we might surprise you. That's UK TV your way. That's UK TV play. And also what fries me is that not long ago, last year in fact, UK TV Play launched four new fast channels. I know. And recently as well, they recently took to social media back in January and un unleashed a new colour of the UK TV Play logo. <sighs> Not to mention that UK TV Play actually officially rebranded itself in 2022. Also the same year, its hugely popular entertainment channel Dave rebranded as well. And let me tell you, that their new look looks absolutely amazing. But rebranding it to you and Dave, oh boy, they've got a lot, lot of thinking about to do. But enough of yesterday, Dave, W and drama. What about Gold, Eden and Alibi? Well, UK TV have also stated that those three paid channels will later rebrand as, as You and Gold, You and Alibi and You and Eden later this year. But I've got to be honest, Eden has to, has to shut down. I mean, just look at their schedules recently. Less nature programmes, as the channel originally launched for, and more... Lifestyle? So anyway, back to the letter U. Well, I'm telling you, if these companies keep carrying on renaming themselves as as letters, I'm seriously going to... don't know what I'm going to do, actually. Oh, boy. And I thought, and I thought Elon Musk renaming Twitter as X was bad. But at least we have an artist's impression of what the new UK TV logo should look like. So, in conclusion, UK TV certainly has a rich history of, of, of programmes as well as its channels, but rebranding itself to a letter is such a ridiculous idea. So yeah, you better enjoy UK TV play as it is, as well as the UK TV network, because this summer it's all going to change rapidly. So. We can, we, we can always assure that even though when you does come along, we, we will always remember the station and forever call it UK TV.